Yo, what's going on, it's boy Kamal. Well, welcome back to another video. As you guys can see, man, I'm drained. I can't lie. I've played so many squad battle games in the last like two, three days. But today we have a Sergio Gomez review. Obviously, he came out in the Defenders Evo for the Future Stars. He's five foot seven, high medium with five star skills and four star weak foot. Left footed, of course, which is nice. Um, he's got good pace. Uh, shooting's a bit. Eh, it's a bit here and there. Uh, passing is very good. Dribbling is very good. Defending is good for left back as well. And physicals are not too bad. They're kind of, eh, they're a bit, uh, you know what I mean? They're a bit, eh. But today, guys, we're going to play him as a midfielder. Because I feel like a lot of people are going to be doing this card and putting them into midfield. I, I think he's a little bit too slow for uh, left back. However, we're going to take a look and see. I might put him into left back eventually in game. Uh, but yeah, guys, 99 agility, 98 balance. I mean, this card looks absolutely incredible. So there's a team we are going to be using him in. And uh, yeah, if you are new to the channel, then drop a little like and subscribe. We're on the road to 4,000 subscribers. I think we hit 3.8k, so I appreciate the love and support, guys. And um, yeah, let's get straight into it. We're playing Elite Division. <laughs> Elite Division, guys. So if you guys don't see the best highlights, <laughs> don't judge me. Sergio Gomez on the ball. Five star skills, pass that. Good pass out to Pele. That was very nice. Sergio Gomez, oh my days, what a pass. Oh, that was unlucky. That was a very nice pass. That was a very good pass, man. Sergio Gomez, good dribbling. He got that situation nicely. Now let's switch that because he's got so many bodies on the left hand side. That was a good switch as well. Good run from Gomez. Can we find the pass? Great pass into Pele. Unlucky. We couldn't get the turn there, but it seems like his passing is really nice, chat. So far, his passing is great. We'll play from Gomez there. Get a little quick pass from Gomez. He's got it back now. Five-star skills. Oh, my days. Look, at the, look how fast he is. Oh, that was well played. Can we get the assist? Oh, unlucky. Oh, he still got it. He still got the ball. Let's see if we can go down the wing here. Nah, unlucky. But yeah, he done he done really well there. The five star skills really does come in handy. Gomez, good turn into Zico. Now let's see if we can get another Travella off. Gomez, Buro, Travella, White Time. Oof. Bit of a bet angle there. Unlucky. If we green those, I feel like it can go in though. Oh my days, oh my, oh my days, the dribbling. Obviously the shooting's not that great on him, but the dribbling there was nuts. Bro, cause I didn't even mean to do a fake shot and he still managed to go around Van Dyke there, that was mad. Good turn. I can't lie, he's really like silky with these sort of skills into the passes in the midfield. Look how quick he turns as well. Fizz that into the middle, oh that's a great pass. Nice, that was all Gomez there, man. He done really well. He done really well. Good dribbling into the pass. Go back with him. Oh my god. Ah, oh, he moved keeper again, but the dribbling on this card is not a joke. Let's see if we can get another Travella with him. I'm gonna keep forcing it until we can get a good one. Green time. Oh that's unlucky. I don't think he's got it in him, chat. I think his uh, shooting stats are a bit too low. Here we are with Gomez again. Getting chased by George Best. Look how he just dribbles out of these situations, man. It's actually mad. Look at his dribbling, chat. Oh my days. I see that run from Zico. Can I hit that? Oh my days, that's a great pass. Oh, unlucky. I got my head to it, but... Good pass out to, Go to Athena from Gomez. Gomez, oh my days. Bro, the 99 agility on this card is crazy. Look at this card, chat. Oh, bro, this guy is really like sweating so hard. I'm just doing a review. Let me just get a goal, man. Go on, Gomez. Well played, Gomez. Green, no, it's not a green, but ah, oh, man, the Travellers chat is shooting is too bad to get the Travellers off, I think. Oh, no. <laughs> I mean, you can see that he's really good in the dribbles, of course. He gets into the space. 
very easily to be fair as well but it's just unfortunate that he's just he's shooting it just lets him down completely we can try and get another Traveller off here <laughs> There's a, no he's not even on the corners anymore look he's just had enough where is he where is he oh he's sitting back here now Green time Traveller. Oh my god, I can't get one going, chat. This is. <laughs> Alright, guys, so that's the end of the review there on Sergio Gomez. Now, we played, I think, like two or three games with him. He was pretty decent. Obviously, his standout was his dribbling. His dribbling is absolutely unbelievable. And I might even say this right now. I personally have not used Timothy and Messi. However, I think this Sergio Gomez has the best dribbling in this game. From any player I've used in this whole entire game, I think this Sergio Gomez has the best dribbling. Now, I did play him as a center mid in, obviously, um, a 4-4-2 and a 4-3-2-1. Now, I'm not going to lie, guys. I took a lot of shots with him. A lot of Travellers, a lot of finesses, and uh, even just normal in-the-box shots. And he just was not delivering. He's definitely not going to be a box-to-box -box center mid, so please avoid using him as a box-to-box. -box. He definitely does not have the shooting capabilities to do so. His pace is really nice, especially with the step-overs. He is flying. I can see him being very very used in a, in a left-back position, 100%. As a center mid and a DM, he doesn't really get too many interceptions. Even though his interceptions are 90, he doesn't really have any good um, defensive capabilities in terms of intercept play style or even anticipate so he doesn't really get a lot of tackles in the midfield however when he when he's out on the left back position he does get a few more tackles obviously in a one-on-one -on -one situation however when the ball's moving around you know either side of him he doesn't really get the reach because he's only five foot seven and uh, yeah physicals are also a downside with his card as well but i mean overall the passing was absolutely incredible the dribbling was the best i've used in this game the pace was really nice as well the defending was solid on one-on-one -on -one situations however like i said the actual interceptions and stuff were not that great physicals were a bit bad and the shooting was terrible as well so overall i'm gonna rate this card a nice 7.5 to 8 out of 10 definitely not going to be full meta however it's a very fun card if you want to use him as a left back i highly suggest using him as a left back and do not use him in the midfield because he just doesn't have the physical capabilities to do so as well as the shooting stats so definitely play him as a left back guys hopefully you guys did enjoy and uh yeah an elite division bro it's so hard to make reviews in elite division so hopefully you guys really do appreciate this sort of review and um yeah see you in the next one peace